case so cool. The story of skirt put me in a cafe. Now in the penitentiary, you always got your guys who claim that they had the baddest. I'm talking about the fan. I'm talking about foreign junts, big junts, small junts, white junts, black junts. They claim they have gals, but they don't never have a way to show that they have them. And these dudes always be the ones who pulling up on dudes who got gals and asking, man, can you put me in the car? And if you don't know what put me in the car is, they let me know you ain't never been to the penitentiary. And if you ain't never been to the penitentiary, listen, I advise you to never go to the penitentiary. But you got to be careful of these folks who saying put me in the car. Because listen, let me tell you something. These folks going to ask you, can you put you in the car once they look at your pictures? They going to see which one they want. Man, what's this gal? It's always a build up, man, put me in the car. These dudes will go so far as to go through your social media. Cause you know they got cell phones in the penitentiary now. As you know, if you watch TikTok, then you done seen people in the penitentiary and people still ask the same question. How them folks on the phone? It's a cell phone. That, that, that's what that is. So at this point, a lot of dudes who locked up, they got social media. And if you got social media in the penitentiary, guess who gonna be following you more than anybody? Probably your friends, your family. Your sister. And your sister probably going to be in the comment section every now and then, which is a, other people going to know, man, bro, got a social media. Them folks will go through the social media, see this person who consistently, and all she got to say is something that lets you, yeah, and next thing you know, they in the DM. So we got this brother, you know what I'm saying? I like to call him, put me in the cop for, right? So I'm in the cell one day, I'm cool, chilling, minding my business. I'm on FaceTime, you know what I'm saying? With my girl, I'm talking to her, she talking back. We converse, we having a whole little conversation, right? And as I'm in here, somebody tap on the door, pop, 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 pop. I look at the door, door look at me, me and the door look at each other. And I'm already saying to myself, as one of the guys right there, I don't even say nothing. But my gal, she hear the door. She said, you ain't gonna say nothing? I said, man, it's one of the guys, ain't it? I said, you already. I said, man, what's up? Man, let me holler at you real quick, G-Body. She started laughing. I'm laughing at her. Both of us laughing together, right? I said, man, come on in, bro. He popped the door. Pow. I'm looking at him. He looking at me. We looking at each other. I said, man, what's up, my guy? He said, man, I ain't doing nothing. Man, ain't cool and chilling, man. You know what I'm saying? Really will finna ask you if I can use the jack real quick. My guy heard him say that. She holler, uh, oh, we on the phone. And he was like, oh, what's up, sis? What's going on, sis? At that point, you know what I'm saying, I turned the phone. So, you know, you form a little family, you know what I'm saying, in a penitentiary, you know what I'm saying? And some of the guys, you know, you let your people speak to or whatever, whatever. She was like, man, what's up, bro? And get what he say. Man, put me in the car, sis. And at that point, she say, oh, my homegirls don't do inmate. Sis, I'm finna get out in a year. Come on, man, put me in the car. I said, babe, bro. You need to use the phone. I said, man, yeah, let me use the phone. I said, man, I said, man I'm going to call you back in a minute. I'm going to call you back in a minute. So I get out the phone, right? Pow. I said, here you go, bro. He said, man, why sis be acting like that, bro? I said, man, I don't know. He said, man, I know you got some other ones, you know what I'm saying? I done seen you at visit with the other junk, you know what I'm saying? Ask the other junk. I said, bro, that's over with. So he used the phone real quick, right? You know what I'm saying? He get out the phone, boom. Get the phone back to me. Couple days go by. I'm down in the park, you know what I'm saying? I'm I'm rapping with Cuz, you know what I'm saying? He actually was just talking to me about his gal, you know what I'm saying? So as we standing by the steps, put me in the car for come down. He ear hustling. He hear what we talking about. He come around the corner. Skirt. Man, what's up, G? I, what's up, bro? I show him some love. Man, what's up, Cuz? Man, what y'all talking about? He done already hear what we talking about. Cuz like. Man, I was just telling Joe T, you know what I'm saying, my gal, and this, this, and that. He said, man, bro, you talking about the junk? You, you, you be going to visit every week, you talking about? I look at bro, I like, what he? I already know where this going. He holler. Man, she got some friends. Cuz, hey, man, she got a few of Man, put me in the car, cuz. Put me in the car. I just look at him. Cuz, hey. Man, I ain't finna go through all that, you know what I'm saying? I ain't finna go through all that. Man, that's crazy, man. So when Cuz, Cuz, he said, man, I'm gonna holler at you, Joe T. He showed me some little head, yeah, bro. He walk off. Bro, holler. Man, that girl ain't even that bad, Joe T. I, I was in the city when a couple weeks ago, seeing the pictures or whatever. Man, I had the baddest junks on the town. I really wouldn't even fool with her. You know what I'm saying? She coming up here to visit and come. Man, she ain't even all that. I look and I said, 
I said, bro, you be talking about these gals all the time. Ain't nobody never seen them, though. Man, they bad, though, Joe T. They so bad. They ain't hold nobody down in prison. They going on to the next one, right? I said, that was up, bro. I show them some love. I go on about my business. So one day, I'm in the cell with cousin, and we all in here, you know what I'm saying? We chilling, you know what I'm saying? And sometimes, you know what I'm saying, when you in the cell, there's groups, you know what I'm saying? A lot of people, you know what I'm saying, they like to snap up, send pictures, post them, or whatever. And while we in here rapping, Brother knock on the door. Pop, pop, pop. Hey, what up, though? I look at Cud, them Cud look at me, me and all of us. We look at each other, right? They know it's, it's bro. I said, man, what's up, bro? He come in the cell. Pop. Man, bless his ear. I said, man, bro, what you got going on? We show everybody show some love, right? And at that point, Cud was like, man, we ain't doing nothing. You know what I'm saying? He see Cud got the phone in his hand. And Cud say, finna get ready to post this picture real quick. Bro say, oh, man, let me get in the picture. What y'all finna post on Facebook? And at this time, Pimpsons rules in effect. Only he, he asking what social media because he nine times ten he finna go get on somebody else's phone and he finna go look at the post and nine times ten he finna go through the, the comment section and he finna try to find somebody that he can jump in the car with. So when he say that, I just kind of look at him, right? He was like, man, come on, bro, put me in a picture real quick. So we all, he set the phone up, you know what I'm saying? We all post up, you know what I'm saying? Penitentiary posing, you know what I'm saying? I'm like this here, you know what I'm saying? Brother, hit up the, he done hit up the racks, you know what I'm saying? Y'all notice I didn't hit up the racks because the feds might be watching. And if the feds watch, I want the feds to know right now, I, I'm not affiliated. I'm not, I'm not gang gang, you know what I'm saying? I'm a, I'm a YouTuber, you know what I'm saying? You can go through my videos and you can see what's going on. I'm just trying to let y'all know what used to go on, you know what I'm saying? But uh, so yeah, he he hit up the racks, the cud, them, you know what I'm saying? They hit the big C's up or whatever, the other cud, you know what I'm saying? He like this here, you know what I'm saying? So we all sitting up here posing. We take the picture right. <laughs> he take the picture. He man, let me see the picture real quick, bro. Holler. I'm already knowing when you post this, somebody gonna be trying to come see me. Somebody gonna be trying to come see me. <laughs> What's up, bro? What do you got going on? So, bro, post the picture. Keep in mind, bro, come holler me to use the jack. You know what I'm saying? A day or so, come back, go back. Bro, pull back up on me. Pow, pow, pow. Man, what's up? Man, they holler at you real quick, Joe T. Come in the see it. Man, bless you, man. I need to get on the horn real quick. Joe T, you on man? I said, I got you, bro. I ain't doing nothing right now. Anyway, I'm finna run out here to the microwave here. You can use it real quick. I give bro the phone. When I give bro the phone, I go and strike down to the microwave. Brother jumped on Facebook to go check the likes and comments and all this old stuff. And it's a girl in the comment on Cub page that said, free, free my big bro and free the guys. So in saying that, he know that Cub's sister, but he, you know what I'm saying, he clicked on the picture, seen what she looked like. He jumped in Cub's sister DM. Man, what's up with you, man? You know what I'm saying? I'm locked up with your brother and all this, this and that, right? She respond, say she don't want to rap. Get what he do. Take the, he took his shirt off, took some pictures, sent it to her, man. You don't want all this right here? Like, what's up? Like, she hit back and say, man, don't message me no more or whatever, whatever, whatever. You already know what time it is. I, and, and, and some of y'all watching this, and it relate to you. You, you, you can't accept rejection. I don't know what your problem is. You know what I'm saying? I ain't never been like it. If a woman say she don't want to talk to you, she don't want to talk to you. You know what I'm saying? I, I done been let down, you know what I'm saying, the soft way a couple of times. You know what I'm saying? Hurt my ego, too. I ain't even going to sit here and stunt to you. You know what I'm saying? I done tried to holler at some nice ones. You know what I'm saying? Well, listen to them. I got, what's up, babe? You know what I'm saying? For all y'all who turned me down, yeah, 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 yeah. She look better than all of you. Yeah, I said it. <laughs> yeah, boy. But anyway, I done, had, I done been around some of my homeboys that, when the girls say, no, nah, all oh, they bees and you're ugly anyway. And you know what I'm saying? They just cut up on them, right? I, I ain't never understood that. So I'm guessing they kind of pressed on, bruh, that way. And he responds in this girl, DM, man, I ain't want you no, and call this girl a bee. Like she wasn't going to tell could. So I'm in the pod one day, you know what I'm saying? I'm just walking around, I'm cooling, you know what I'm saying? Bruh doing his jumping jacks. Bruh doing jumping jacks. And as I, I look up, could come out of the cell and he say, hey, 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 put me in the car, folk. And I look, because it's the tone. Penitentiary rules is in effect. It's, it's in the tone. By that time, other could come out, because he probably know the could voice. He come out from the bottom, right? He said, what's up, could? He was like, man, nothing. I need to holler. He was like, man, I need to holler, bro. So I look up. I was like, what's up, could? He was like, man, everything straight, Joe, Joe T. At this point, you know what I'm saying? He probably want to handle it man to man. So, bro, get through doing his jumping jack. 
He walked past me. When he walked past him, you know, so he straight. Ah, oh, yeah, yeah, I'm good, I'm, I'm good. So he go up the step. Soon as he go up the step, Cud didn't even greet, bro. You know what I'm saying? He pushed, bro. He, man, man, what's up with you? Bro, push him back. He like, man, what's up with you? At this point, I come up the step, man, what's going on? Cud grabbed his homeboy. He said, man, what's up, Cud? He said, man, Cud in my, in, my, in my sister DM. I said, man, y'all step in the cell real quick. So we step in the cell. When we step in the cell, he said, man, he said, man, I ain't trying to hear none of that, man. Brother, I'm disrespecting my sister, man. And such, such. He pulled the phone out. Ah. He showed a message. He said he wanted one. It was at this moment that he knew he f***ed up. Right then and now. But the, so you already know what time it is. Assume the position. We do the pat down. Me and Cuz step outside and though I look at Cuz, I said, man, that's crazy. He said, man, that is crazy, man. And at that point, I don't think you could hear. Skirt, skirt, do, do, skirt, skirt, do, 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 skirt, skirt, do, 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 By the time the fight over, I tapped on the door. Pow, pow, pow. Man, what's up? I said, y'all straight? Yeah, 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 we straight, we straight. They popped the door. Pow. I said, man, what's up, bro? He said, man, I'm straight, bro. Come on up, come on, bro. So we walking down the steps. I said, you still want me to put you in the car? And I'm good, bro. I'm straight on all that, bro. That's crazy, bro. Like, that's crazy. The good news is, I'ma lower the prices for you, my boy. The way that we bought is unlimited. Man, you ain't gotta worry about none of that no more. Okay, so boom, this looted. Been in the game all his life. All he know is the streets. Man, I knew it was him. Don't cross him. I'll tell you what you can do. What you mean? What you can do? Oh, what you mean? Huh? Say it in my chair. Hey. Here we go. Come and turn up if you win and let make a decision. We built for this. Don't play with me, Cinco. Why is she texting me? Hustle for paper, we getting it. What you been saying might be right about an old boy. You know, his dad be going over getting the hurt done. Going to get with brother. Been getting money all his life. His only problem is, he gonna put that money before anything or anybody. So if he gotta cross you out, trust me, it's by all means necessary. You remember I was over a couple days ago when I brought you a bag, right? Cause my dude, he tripping. Everybody tripping on the price. So basically we got some good news and some bad news. Which one you want first? We wanna fuck this bitch at me. Come and turn up if you win and let make a decision. We built for this. Then she down at the goddamn house talking about this. Ah, oh, damn. Shit. Goddamn trash can jumped down in front of me, nigga. Shit. Ah, damn. Hold on now. God.